Hello, guys. All right, let's get right into it. Today we're talking about um, last three definitions, FICA, Social Security, and Medicare. Um, so FICA is called the Federal Insurance Contributions Act, um, and that is made up, so it's basically um, one percentage that includes Social Security, and Medicare. Um, this is money not for federal taxes, but it is money that goes to our government. So like if you don't, often if you don't make enough money at your job, um, then you don't have to pay taxes because you haven't hit that point where you would actually have to pay taxes, but everybody pays this no matter what. Even if you only get paid $1,000 next year, you definitely will have FICA taken out. Social Security is um, money that helps people who don't work. It's kind of like a retirement account. Um, so this is retirement, but it's not for one individual person. Like your money goes into this giant um, retirement account um, for everybody in the United States and it gets taken out for everybody in the United States. So if you want like a really nice retirement, you need to have your own savings for that. Um, but if you want a minimal, barely be able to live, but you will be able to live retirement, FICA is the way to go. Um, so basically you need to have your own retirement. But this is money that goes towards everybody. It also goes towards people who are disabled and cannot work. And it also goes towards people who are survivors, as in like uh, either survivors um, from um, military uh, problems um, or survivors uh, like if your spouse dies um, and you are left with you know, raising a whole family by yourself, that kind of thing, um, Social Security will go towards you as well. Um, Medicare is specifically medical insurance Um, for uh, people who need it, um, specifically retired people, uh, disability, basically everything that's on this list, but this is the part that's medical insurance. This part is just money to live, and this part is medical insurance. So together, that makes up 7.65% um, of your uh, paycheck. They take away 7.65% for that. And then Social Security um, is made up of uh, let's see, that is 6.2%. Sorry about all the things my computer's doing. Um, and uh, the other one is 1.45%. So you can see that if you add these two together, you get that one. All right. Stop making noises, computer. Let's see if I can turn that off. Okay. So um, these two added together equals 7.65%, which is what they take away. And that does not include your federal taxes or your state taxes, because the federal tax money that you have taken out and the state tax money you have taken out, you get back if you don't make enough that year. But these two are taken out no matter what, and together they are called FICA. So on your homework, which is right here, and it's a pretty brief assignment. And this is going to be due with the other assignment that is happening during your benchmark. Um, it's going to be due on Monday because we're going to be taking the benchmark over three days. Um, so this is due on Monday. And you also aren't going to have to do all of them. We're going to do Janice together. And then let's have you guys do Rob, Susan, and Ted. OK? So it looks like Janice uh, makes $2.15 per hour. She worked 15 hours, so her earnings from her wages are, I have to take, there's my calculator, <clears throat> I need to take $2.15 times 15 hours, and it looks like Janice must be a, um, I assume a waitress or somebody like that, somebody who gets tips, that's for sure, and it says meals here, so I'm guessing a waiter. Okay, so Janice normally gets $32.25 just from, like, she gets paid that no matter what. Even if nobody comes to the restaurant, she gets paid that. Tips, we're using 15%. Um, 
uh, to go for tips. So I'm going to hit 0.15 times the $900 that was bought today. So she got $135 in tips. Pretty impressive. So her total pay is $135 plus $32.25, um, which makes a total of $167.25. Okay? And then the FICA, to figure that out, you're going to multiply by that 7.65%. And 7% is actually 0.07, because 1 is 100%. So you're going to multiply by 0 0.0765. And you're going to take that total play and multiply that. So you're going to take 167.25 times 0 0.0765, which is um, $12.00 and 79 cents. So that's how much FICA would be withheld. Um, so your total paycheck would be one, or at least Janice's total paycheck would be 167, and her FICA that she withheld would be $12.79. Okay, so remember your homework is Rob, Susan, and Ted. If you are taking the benchmark today, which is Wednesday, then you do not need to do this lesson on Wednesday. You can do it tomorrow because over the next three days, there is the benchmark, that's one, and then there are two lessons. And over the three days, we'll cycle through them. So at the end of three days, at the end of Friday, everybody's taken the benchmark and we've gotten two lessons in and then that combined assignment will be due on Monday. So this assignment's due on Monday. Make sure you have that ready. And that's it. I hope you guys... Have a terrific day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.